Hey guys, what is up? Today we're gonna to be um, installing some seat covers on my Escalade, this is 2004. Um, and this is the GMT 100 platform. So um, it's these seat covers right here. Now I ordered my seat covers from Texan Auto, Texan seat covers or something like that. I'll link them down below and I'll show you here in a second. But um, my conundrum was paying the 200 and something dollars for, I'm just doing the lower cushions. So I was like, do I pay the 200 something dollars for the seat shop ones? or these Texan ones looked actually really good too, and they had some good reviews. So I'm trying those out, and I'm gonna give, give you a review afterwards. All right, so this one's getting done, this back one's getting done, and this one's getting done. Uh, sorry, not the back, but the, the bottoms are getting done. Let me show you the actual seat covers themselves. Okay, so these are the seat covers themselves. They feel good. This is, if you don't know about GMT 100 trucks, if you wanna change out your seat covers, this is the truck to have. I mean, it's pretty easy to do on these things. Um, it's just literally like clips that hold it in. You don't gotta mess with hog rings or anything, but the material seems really nice. It's got a little, it's got a little, how can I explain this? It's got a little bit of cushion to it. Um, so they'll probably be a little bit softer than the factory ones I have in there. Um, and they have the perforated leather here, just like the stock. You have everything it wraps around, um, but it feels really good just like this, like it feels good. We'll see once it's stretched over the fabric on the inside of the truck what it feels like. And we'll cut to that here in just a minute. So this is the old seat cover. Here's the new, we flip that up real quick. This is the new one right here. There we go. Also, we didn't take the seat apart. Some people I've seen on YouTube take the bottom from the top. We didn't do that. Um, and I say we loosely, I didn't do anything. I've just been sitting here making fun of them doing it. So, um, they had didn't take it apart, but I suppose we'll probably be able to get the seat cover back on without that. We'll see. Any pointers that you have for anybody? Uh, work gloves. Okay, that's too much. It's gonna suck with your hand. Be careful of these metal tabs here. Yeah. This stuff has got a little, it needs a little deeper in it, one could say. And I'll just let these monkeys hump a doorknob and see if they figure this out. Give it a one out of 10 on the difficulty scale of wrapping that seat stuff. First one, a six, this one, I don't know why, but it's a little more difficult. Probably yeah. like an eight. But it's good because they're tight and they probably won't come off. Okay, so skipping forward, uh, seat covers are installed. Um, they do look really well. One of the cool benefits of putting the new seat covers in is you get that new car smell. So pros and cons, let's get into the pros. They look good, they feel good, the perforation looks really good. Um, they're soft, they're supple, they do feel like really good, like quality material. Um, like they're, I don't know how to tell a great leather, but this feels really good, right? I already got some, I already got some stains here. But I've got the truck parked um, where like that side's in the sun and this side isn't. And I wanna show you something, right? So this is the main issue I have with the seat covers and it's not a huge issue, but if you look here in the shade, right? These look pretty closely color matched, right? Like the, the different materials look pretty closely color matched. If you can see, I'll get you some different angles. Now, of course, this back with time um, has gotten like just darker just because of people sitting on it. So it's gonna be a little bit darker than this, but it's pretty closely color matched, right? And I have the gray interior, the, the pewter gray, I think is what it is. And when we get to the side on the sun, I'm not sure if you can tell that much, um, but this is a more drastically different color than that on that side where the shade is, right? So it's like in different lighting, it looks closer or farther away from the actual shade of the seat, like the, the pewter gray. So this to here is different and it's a different on that side too, but the amount of difference from here to here is more, it's more of a difference than that to me. Now it's hard to kind of explain it or show it on camera, I guess. Now let's let's also preface something real quick. I am a color, I'm colorblind, right? So I'm not the best with like color accuracy or seeing what's accurate. But in the shade here, this to me looks way more color matched than this does in the sun. And let me adjust my settings. You can see the difference there in the, the shades. It's all, I mean, it's new, but it also looks like a different shade almost. But here, when we get back in the shade and the overcast, like uh, it's like the same color. But these seat covers feel really good. Again, they're very soft. They have the perforated leather here and it's hard to describe what it is. It's like more supple, but also like you feel the perforations more than here. So I bet that the seat heater works better on this seat cover than the old one. Um, but this, this is like a hard, 
here I can yeah I can show you with sound. I got a shotgun mic. I'm gonna point the microphone. I'm scratching the bottom. Now I'm scratching the back. It's bottom. Back. Okay, so you can feel this is just real slick and this has like a texture to it. Like it just feels better. But all in all, I'm happy. The truck looks way better on the inside now. It also has that new car smell like I was saying earlier. So that's one of those intangible things. It's like, it just makes you enjoy getting in this thing because it smells like a new car now because of these seat covers, which is pretty cool. I don't know how long that will last, um, but it's a pretty cool benefit. Um, so yeah, that's my review of the Texan Auto Seat Covers. I'll link them down below. They're like half the price of the Seat Shop or the whatever the, the company is that sells those expensive uh, seat covers for the GMT 800 trucks. Any questions you have, throw them in the comments down below. Again, I am colorblind, so you might see something totally different than I see. And this is just on a camera. This is my Sony A7S III filming this. Um, so, you know, is my color profile correct? I don't know. But in, I can, in my naked eye, I can see the difference in that and that, and in the sunlight, that and that color. So... Anyways, anything you have, any questions you have, throw them in the comments down below. Uh, you can like the video if it was helpful for you. You can also subscribe if you want as well. Uh, I do a bunch of like car projects and car content on here and then just also like general reviews of stuff. Check the other videos out before you subscribe just to make sure you're into that kind of stuff. Anyways, guys, that's it. Have a great day. Thanks for watching. Bye.